Hey girls, it's Friday, except I might be posting this on Saturday or Sunday. I am filming in the lounge because my roommate is sleeping and I'm actually like really scared that someone's gonna come in and there's gonna be like a really awkward moment. Um, <laughs> I'm recording a vlog for YouTube. Oh! Yeah. Really? Yep. But anyway, I'll see. Yeah, as you can see, there are like vending machines in the back of me. Which city would I move closer to me? My first inclination, which is what I'm going to go with, uh, was to move New York City closer to me for a number of reasons. It's a cool city. Johnny and Natalie and Sean and Rob, Broadway shows. There's a bus that goes from New York City to DC, $40 round trip. And that's really cheap, so then I'd be able to get home really easily. So that'd be really nice. Uh, Veronica, I'm not sure what iMovie I have, like what version it is, but I'm guessing that's why, I, yeah, I do appear in that little box. I never knew why, and I, I wish I could fill up the whole screen, but I don't know how. So a dream that I've had. So I've started writing down my dreams again because um, I used to write them down and then I kind of stopped and now I'm writing them down again. So far I have two dreams written down. And I looked at both of them, and both of them are inappropriate, <laughs> however you want to interpret that. There was one part of one of the dreams that's appropriate. It's, it's kind of weird. It was, it was basically like I was driving, and I think it was like Colesville Road. I'm pretty sure I was on Colesville. So I turned my turn signal on to get into the next lane. And so I was getting into the next lane, and then all of a sudden it turned into the sidewalk. And then all of a sudden my car was gone, and it had turned into a stapler. So I was like holding this stapler, and I was walking along the sidewalk and I wasn't really sure what to do. And then the sidewalk started turning into this like, you know those like brick ledges that are sometimes along sidewalks that you would like walk on when you were a little kid. It would like, it turned into one of those. So then the ledge started getting higher and higher and higher. And then I got down on my knees and I was like, I was acting like the stapler was a little car and I was rolling it along the ledge. And then suddenly the ledge was gone and I was back on the road and the stapler had turned back into a car and I was driving. It was really odd. I wish I had a better dream to tell you. Veronica's question, do you get obsessed with things in general, like anything? Yeah, I do. If, if I like something a lot, I'll like be obsessed with it for a while. Right now, I wouldn't say I have an obsession really, but um, I have this friend here, his name is Mitchell, and he loves the band Seeger Rose. It's this Icelandic band. I've listened to some of their stuff and they're really, really good. I've been, I've been listening to that a lot. Actually, I don't know if you guys have this at your school, but it's really cool. In my dorm, there's this thing where you can like share your iTunes library and you go into iTunes and under shared, there's like whoever's on their iTunes, it shows up if they want it to be shared, mine isn't shared. So it's really cool because you can like stock people's libraries and that's how I was listening to that song all the time. Have I done a lot of good shopping? The answer to that question is I wish. Like I've been to the Commons, which is just like the downtown area of Ithaca. There are so many cool stores there. Like it is prime location for a fun day of shopping and getting cool things that you wouldn't find anywhere else. Like, and they have, they have really cute clothes and every time I go in there, I'm like, oh my gosh, I wish I could just spend money, but I can't. So my question for the- That's one reason why I hate being in here because the damn moons won't shut up. So 
You know when something's really funny and you start laughing and you can't stop laughing and like your stomach starts to hurt and your mouth starts to hurt but you still can't stop and it's like the greatest thing ever and it hardly happens, like it doesn't happen that much but when it does, it's an amazing thing. My question is when that was for you. What was the last time that you laughed really, really hard you couldn't stop? And why, why were you laughing? I wanna know. The last time that, that happened to me, uh, let's, say, let's just say, I was very happy for a certain reason, but if you get my meaning. I don't want to say it and I don't feel sketchy saying that in a vlog. So I thought everything was funny. So I was in the lounge with my friend Dylan and he's the most random person. He says the most random things. Oh, and I was also with my friend Mitchell and we were just like sitting there like talking and laughing and stuff and Mitchell was like, I wonder what would happen if I showed the Jewish star to Santa Claus. And then Dylan was like, <laughs> he turned into a bat. <laughs> it was so funny. I could not stop laughing. I was laughing so hard. Like my stomach hurt so much that I wanted to stop, but I could not. It was so funny. Yeah, so this week has been so cold and so rainy. The leaves are already starting to change, which I guess is okay. I don't mind changing leaves. But like today it was 45 degrees in the morning and then the high was 50 and it's been like really rainy and it's been bumming me out. It sucks. I'm excited because my mom is coming tomorrow. My mom and my stepdad and we're gonna do stuff. Wanna see a view out the window? I love doing this. Oh, doesn't that look cool? This is a view out the window. That's, I don't know how, you, how much you can see, but that's, um, that's the front of my dorm. You have to walk out there to go to the rest of campus. I feel like I could do a waltz with the computer. La, 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 la. I don't know why I'm singing into the woods. La, 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 la. Okay, if someone walked in right now, I would look so ridiculous. I'm dancing with my computer. So that's all. Um, I hope you guys have a good weekend and talk to you soon and I'll, I'll, I'll be seeing you soon, which would be cool. All right, love you. Bye. That's what I go to school for. I don't have anything funny to put at the end of this video. I thought I told you to shut up!